Hello, hello, hello. I'm alive. Okay, I'm live. <laughs> uh, let's check the chat if it works. Let's check. Okay, I think it works. It works. Okay. So, so, so. What we're going to do today is Madrak. I know it's been a while. I mean, if we go to Twitch. <laughs> if we go to Twitch. I think my last, uh, my last, uh, stream is like two months ago or something. <laughs> Sorry, I, I've been busy. I, I have a job now. I have a full-time job. I'm really thankful that I have a full-time job. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I didn't go to college like I myself thought that, so I'm just happy, okay, that someone out there, like a company, gave me a chance. Uh, yeah, I'm just really thankful. <laughs> And I've I've stayed with them for like I don't know uh, maybe around two months I think I started around this week yeah it was before my birthday I remember it but I actually started working around this week so late October and then yeah and, and it's now December nine and yeah. I think it's just really, really cool, really awesome that yeah. I get to work with them and I get paid to do something I enjoy because I generally enjoy coding. <laughs> One of the reasons I'm also st streaming, right? So, since I don't, I have a full-time job now, I don't really have much time. Uh, free time, I mean, I don't really have a lot of free time. But I, I've been working on like side projects for a bit. Uh, one of the things I've worked on, I, I'm, I don't know if you remember it, but on my last streams, I showed how to deploy uh, Hugo, Hugo, a Hugo blog, right, to Cloudflare. Uh, and currently, it's like this now, like, I, uh, it's like 90 commits now, so I've been working it, on it for a while. I, I mean, I didn't really change much, but one of the things that I did was, one of the things I did that you will notice immediately is, uh, I changed I changed the color scheme. Of course, I, it it follows the Vercel color color scheme, like black and then the colors. Uh, what else? What else? Yeah, there's a bit of animation. I, I this is like su subtle changes, but the thing that I'm really proud of <laughs> is that Hugo Hugo page uh Hugo sites like Hugo is like a static site generator, so meaning. Uh, if you go to a new page, I'll, I'll show you, I'll show you. So, like, this is built from Steam Stack, right? Let's go to their demo. View the demo. This is the demo of their site. What is the difference, right? <clears throat> One of the things that you notice is that if I go to a new page, uh, let's say I'm home right now, I'll go to Archives. Right? I'll go to Archives. Okay, no. L let me click on it. See, it, it reloads the whole page. I go to search, reloads the whole page, I'll go to links, it reloads the whole page, go back to home, go to an article, reloads the whole page. See, you see it's loading, right? Because the way Hugo works under the hood is like it you have like a, you have code to to specify how the templates are built, right? Like for example, let's go to the theme. I think it's a theme. You go to the theme. And then I think it's somewhere here. It's, I don't know, not in sample size. I think it's the code is somewhere in, where is it? Assets? Or layout. No, I think it's in layout. Like if we go to like a random page, let's say index.html, you, you have this <clears throat> kind of uh, templating logic, right? You have this logic that you're, you're telling the site how to build uh, this particular, uh, how do I say it? It's, an, it's, it's like this particular template. It's not a page per se. That's like, it has like multiple parts. It's kind of like Jinja. It's kind of like, you know, Django templates. But you're using Hugo. <laughs> Hugo to build it. If you get what I mean, like, and yeah. And because again, it's like a template language, right? Uh, from this, it builds the HTML of it. Like if we, let's say, go to, let's go to 
blog let's go to blog 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 repost and then blog <clears throat> okay i cannot maximize this how do i maximize this type then we this is like the thing and then it generates the content i think here in the resources folder yep it's the generated content no it's in public and it, gener it generates a bunch of html files like for example index the html this is the generated html file from the index that index.html uh from, from here right from here and then it generates this thing so yeah it's it's not like you're using react where you can route things right or you're using i guess path framework like view or angular like we can't really do that because it's a separate html page so that is why when you click on the link it reloads the whole thing yep yep i don't know why i went on a tangent and explaining how these things work <laughs> i didn't i'm not even sure if i properly explained it <laughs> but but i was like i was working i was building a couple projects with uh this technology called hnmx uh in my past streams i've been i've been experimenting a lot with it right this thing called HTMX. I really like using it. But what this essentially does is that you 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 use this kind of dependency which is written in JavaScript, right? So that you don't write JavaScript. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's so cool. The way it works is that when it, it instead of like fetch uh, instead of like when you click on the link it's fetching the whole thing and then reloads the whole page you just fetch uh you just f fetch the parts that you need and then you don't reload the whole page you only reload the parts that change and it's really cool uh i'll give you an example like for example if i go to about page right and then notice notice yep nothing reloads <laughs> If you've noticed, like, there's no reloading happening. There's no reload happening. It's like, it feels as if it's just one page. Of course, there's a, there's a loading bar, but... Uh, whatever. <laughs> I added that bit just for flair. Have we got an article? Yep. We go to another article. Yeah. I thought it was just cool. <laughs> I thought it was just cool that something like Hugo, right, where... It's not really a single page application, but with a technology called HTMX, I was able to build something similar. But this is not a single page application. I'm just mimicking the behavior of single page applications. And if you're curious how I built this, I, I made a post about it. See, everything is here. How I did the progress bar, the page navigation, the transitions. Uh, so you, you get this fade, fade in, fade out effect. On page transition yep uh, uh, if, you're, if you're curious about it just check this blog out at sailor.pages.dev I think I, I think it's on Twitch the the link to my blog I'm not sure I think it's on Twitch but yeah but well, we're not going to do this today I mean I, I'm pretty much I wouldn't say done but I'm pretty happy with how it turned out i'm pretty satisfied uh but what we're going to do today is <laughs> something that i've been doing for a while and i haven't finished it i'm sorry okay it's still 57 commits <laughs> uh I, lately I, I removed the rule that it required a pull request so i could build faster uh this was slowing me down uh you know that requiring a pr on every whenever you push the main but this is like the more this is the industry standard that right? you create a pr for every feature you build but i'll do this again once i'm done with the app <laughs> and then i need i only need to do some maintenance but right now it's like the app is not finished it's 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 still far from completion uh but yeah we're going to do that today and this is it this is the thing that i built Again, I don't really have a lot of time, so that's why you can see it's like nothing. There's nothing. There's only two routes for now. It's overview and then a patient list. Again, I'm using HTMX. 
<laughs> I'm using htmx. You see the hx get hx push URL to save the to save the history to save the link in the history. And I'm not using a partial. The the thing that I did was a new one, which is using. Uh, it's not a new one, but like it's a different kind of approach because there's like the partial approach, and then the other approach is using. Uh, what do you call it? It's not sections. I forgot the, I forgot the term but instead of like fetching the the instead of like fetching partials right you're fetching like let's say this part of the page no no you actually fetch the whole HTML you fetch the whole page <clears throat> but you only uh oh no, no not fetch you generate the whole page <laughs> I let me rephrase that okay so when you're using partials uh in the server right in the server let's say for example I want to get a table I have a I have this data and I want to generate a table for it so the database out oh, the database I mean the, the the back end only generates the HTML for the table with the data that you need and then you bring it back to the client that's how you work with partials and then the other one the other method is like is you don't do that instead you build the whole page you rebuild the whole page the table change within the, the page and then the client only selects the table that you need you only select the thing that you need the thing that change and then that's the thing that you bring back to the client and let's say for example the patient list for example right i have this hx get patient list hx push your all patient list but if you go up if you go up you scroll up a bit i'm only selecting hx select the main so like uh if we go to the inspect button inspect element right let's see where the main is uh as you can see here here see it's main id main so like in the back end i'm generating the whole page this is this whole thing i'm generating the whole thing but i'm not giving it back to the client i'm only giving back what the client needs which is this this hashtag main this id of a main and yeah it's a different thing but the, what this allows me to do is that if for example i go to the if i go to the route of patient list right since patient the route patient list returns a full html page it's not returning a partial right normally if you go to patient list you will get the table back right if you're using the partial report you, you will get the table back only the table back but now if I go to the route patient list, since I'm again generating the whole thing, I get back the full, the whole page. So it, again, it creates this illusion, right, that it's a full stack app, or I mean a, a single page app. But it's not. So it's actually a full stack app, but with but it feels as if it's a single page app. So yeah, I'm also using a how do I say it? Uh, a design uh that I found in the net <laughs> as you can see i've been following the, the design i changed stuff a bit uh <clears throat> and then for the icons i'm using this svg halts uh, this is the only one i could find where it has the icons that i need because i'm building a medical record system so i needed something that yeah has you know s stuff for mm, yeah, the icons that i need yeah yeah and yeah and that's what we're going to do this stream i will i just want to build this thing the patient list i already have the data uh from the patient list uh like a fixture is just test data it's not actual data but <clears throat> i think it's in client yamo yeah i just need to convert this data to this <laughs> that's the thing that i will do uh, i mean it's here too i think it's like client 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 where's client what other clients clients the data is here and i just need to convert this data to this yep and that's what we're going to do today <laughs> it's just front end stuff <laughs> i think front end is kind of chill it takes a while because i'm not a front end dev it takes a while for me to do it <clears throat> but it's doable right it's doable i mean i was able to do this i mean <laughs> even though a lot of this is not working <laughs> you can click on it and stuff but like it doesn't really do anything you can't even log out <laughs> you can't even log out uh yeah, whatever the uh, patient list uh 
patient list.html and then we're just going to do this. <coughs> I wonder about the content.html. <clears throat> oh yeah, yeah. I was actually wondering if I could uh, pass pass data to partials. Oh wait, wait, no, no. Instead of doing that, I think I'll just another components mm, patient list partials page patient list hmm patient html is that okay components no Actually, I just build it here. Why not? I'll just build it here. It's not. It's not even a partial. It's a. It's a page, right? I'll just build it here. Uh... <clears throat> okay. 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 Let's wait. 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 How do I go back? How do I go back? So, so it's like Gmail. It's like an email thing. I'm not sure if I, I would need the icon. It's a simple medical record system, so I, I don't think I need this. Uh, would I want a checkbox, like for deleting? Why would I need a checkbox? Deleting patient, I think. Hmm. So by last appointment. Edit column. Filter. Edit column. Okay, okay, okay. List. Thumbnail. What does thumbnail do? I wonder what th thumbnail do. This is when you click it, okay? <clears throat> so there's a uh, breadcrumb somewhere. Patient list red pump. Mm. Okay, let's just build it. Ah, uh, before building it, I want to fetch the data first. So let's just. I have a div and then let's just fetch it. HX gets clients. I just got I need a route. Views views clients clients that pi views that pi views that pi and clients. Okay. I need a client list view. Client kind of class client list v v uh, pass. Uh, it's getting right. Post is time to create get okay def get list to that get self request get the request and then. I should it be response. Yes. Why well, is it already direct? Because it's posting. Okay. Uh, I guess I need to do some pagination. But let let me fetch everything first. Let me fetch all the clients first. Oh, it's sorry. Do I need the records? No, I don't need the records on the this views. I only need the clients. So clients, this clients, client list, this is a client list client, so and the all reference number, no, we're getting it all. Okay, and then just return the clients. Can I do that? Let's see if I can do that, or do I need to serialize it? Your uh, parse, parse your uh, sys for the reference number. Okay, okay. 
Oke okay, oke. Okay. Uh, pas return on context. Context get stir any equals clients clients and then return render clients. Did, did I return a JSON? Return render request return under request uh context and i need the uh, html file so it will be client list client list uh, html <coughs> so medrack partials Then let's go to Medrack partials, partials, partials. Control Shift E uh, Medrack uh, partials, 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 templates, partials, and then Partials page alerts. Let's go. <coughs> New file. Oh, let's go with current list. There's a monster. I just need to return. For clients and clients. Or is it for each? I add. I have no idea. And then and four. And then just client. Does that work? It doesn't work. So let's see, was there an error? Why is nothing happening? Hmm. Where's the index view? In let's swap. No, it's patient. Patient. Why is it called client list? That's so weird. The page is called patient list. Mm. Ah, because I haven't your L your L uh and list and then swap is should I do in an HTML? Still not working. Why is it not working? Mm, let's check the div. Okay. But syntax error I could not parse it under Ah, because I don't have URLs that pi URLs that pi clients and then a list <clears throat> these that client list view as view. Actually, this is client view, right? Let's see, let's see. I'm not sure if... Uh, let me check, let me check client list, and then let's go to app. URLs, no, I mean URLs are pie of app. Now let's see, it's clients. So, I think clients list should be this. Okay. It doesn't work. <laughs> 
Ah, kas forgot to summon crap at the comma. Could not parse, but I have a client list. Could not parse the remainder of client list from the client list. I have it. Ah, I actually don't know. I have it though. It's in the URLs that pie. So why is it now working? Error during template rendering. This is so weird. I have it. It's here. It's here. Plant list. Or do I have to... Do I have to uh, restart the server? No. Let me think for a second here. How does the URL thing kind of work? Let's see. Maybe I forgot the syntax, how it works. No, it's correct. URL client list. It's correct. It checks uh, load. No, no. It checks init. It checks trigger. <laughs> uh, load once. And it's still not working. Ah, I think I think it's because I'm using double coded the syntax when it should be the <laughs> syntax. My bad. Yeah, it should work. Okay, now it's working. Okay, okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay, okay. And then let's go back to client list. Client list I should know. And then let's just build the table. Let's just build a table out of it. It's a table, right? Is it a table? I think it's a table. Let's go to Daisy I and let's see how tables are made. Components table. Go with table. <laughs> Something like this. But I'm not sure if this is a table format. I guess there's just more, there's like more gap. Yeah. There's more gap in between. Like more, I don't think you can add like a pattern. With, I'm not sure how they did it. Should it go with cards? Like think of this as cards, but there's a label here. So I think it's a table. I think it's a table. Mm. Let's just build it first. So I need a count, right? I need the count of the patients. So there's the views. Uh Or do I need? Can I do it in SQL? I don't think I need to do it in SQL. None counts. Client counts. I'll just go with count. Or num clients. Num clients. <coughs> then I just need to put this thing here. Here. Left side bar. So we can here. Oh, I'm sorry. 
counts. Oh wait, no, it's no, it's non clients or non patients, but I'm using client. It's not working. I don't know why it's not working, but it should work. Maybe land list clients? What does this return? Maybe like land list clients or something? Why can't I refresh? Wait, 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 wait. Why is it not working? Why is it not working? I'm, I'm genuinely confused. I'm genuinely confused. Why is it not working? Why can't I see the num clients? Do I need to refresh it? Okay. Okay. But my question is why am I not getting the number? Of non clients, that is so weird. It should be here. Oh, I'm so bad. <laughs> I'm so bad. <laughs> so I have 100 clients, okay? I just need to do that, and then I need to add a divider here. Divide the post divide all. Oh no, the class, not no. divide the divide all. Okay, okay, okay. We're cooking, we're cooking. What else do I need to do? The divider, and then I need to increase the font of this. So, dev, and then put it inside a div, and then I need to put it inside a span. <laughs> and then bam, bam, bada boom, and I need to make the font bigger. Maybe text XL. Maybe XL. No, to XL. Is that big enough? Same height is same size as this. I'm not sure how big this is. XXL. I'm not sure. XXL. It's new XXL. It's good enough. And then font sunny bold. Or font medium. Font sunny bold. Let's see if that works. Uh, okay, let's go well with PX7. Want some gold and change the change the, the change the color to I'm not sure what color that is. Maybe that's that's primary. I've changed the primary color. I need to change the padding to like <clears throat> So I included the content, right? Content.html. Let's see. Content.html. Just this thing. That should be here. I just need to copy the class. Where's content HTML? now? Just copy the class. I don't need to copy everything from the class. So I have uniform classes. And then I just need to reinvent this. Copy which copy path. Out control C and then DJ HTML minus class. Uh, minus d2 okay and then now the divider should be, should be up here oh wait wait a minute wait a minute 
I also need oh this is hard because I need a divider to be up so I cannot do that okay okay I cannot do this so it has to be okay okay I have to do it again like this so the divider should be Now let's go back, let's go back to patient list. I cannot do this. I cannot do that. Now let's go back to plant list. And then copy this classes from contents. And then this is the main container. I can close this and then I'll put the class here. And then the divider and then I'll put another class here. Okay, that works. That works for me. Ah, uh, why did it stop working? I have no idea. It should not have stopped working. What is happening? Maybe I have to ref No. Did I change anything? Maybe because of the load ones. Trigger load. I'm generally curious. Why is it not loading now? Did that change anything? Oh, it's here. Ah, because of the min hat. Okay, <laughs> that is so bad. That was so bad. So, anyways, I still need to to add a thing, right? I still need to add the min hat somewhere. Of course. Maybe here. Min heights. Uh, where's the thing again? Content deletion now? Oh, no. Content. Each demo and then just copy a thing. I love if it's copy pasting. This is peak <laughs> web development, guys. <laughs> just copy pasting code. Okay, okay. Okay, overview. Answer in peace. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. I wonder why. Ah, I think it's because of the divider, like the the padding that it gives you. Yeah, I think that's it. Because I don't need the the divider, the divider. So I guess I'll <coughs> I'll make it zero then. Or is it margin or is it padding? I think it's. PT0. I mean, no, 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 no. PT0. Let's see, let's see. Or oh, MT0, not PT. Okay. Maybe 3 instead of 5. Or 2, maybe 2. Maybe 3 and then above is like or something. No, I think it's more like two. This one is also two or something. I'm not sure. I'm just eyeballing it, by the way, guys. Okay. And then I need to do the 76 and then patience. Pantless 76. And uh, I need another span. No, span. Patience. 
And then I need a class of text neutral. Text neutral. How do I? I want to resize it, but I will lose. No, <laughs> I want to resize it. Minimize. No, why did I minimize it? That was so stupid of me. That was so stupid of me. Not minimize. I want to resize. I like resizing it manually. Because I cannot use my window key. If I do that, OBS will close and I'll, yeah, I will lose the stream. <laughs> I'll have to restart the stream. Uh, okay. Now we have that, right? We have that. <clears throat> patience, patience, text neutral. That's not really the color I want. Maybe text gray. Maybe text gray. If I wonder, maybe. What color is this? Something similar. Text slate 500. Okay, and then we need to make this display flex. So, div. Yeah, this is how you do <laughs> HTML, by the way. Just, just divs everywhere. Divs everywhere. And then class flex, class equals flex, gap equals maybe three. I also need to align it to bottom, so uh, justify bottom. No, no, I think it's items and or something. Mm, okay, there. It's a line button. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then. Okay, I need to make this font a medium. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> and then. Hundred patience. Got two. Okay. And then I need a divider. So I need a divider. So dev class dot divider. Well, I need a vertical divider. So I think it's here. Here, divider, divider. And then there's like a vertical divider that divider horizontal. horizontal. <coughs> divider vertical. It doesn't work. Maybe divider, divider, her vertical. It's, it's still work. What, 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 what? But it's like divider vertical. On top of each other. Divide ah, divider horizontal, not vertical. I'm so bad. <clears throat> you need something? No. I don't know why it doesn't work. I have no idea why it doesn't work. It should work, but it's not working. So maybe something is wrong. What? Remove it because it's unnecessary. Okay, okay. URL stuff. Bye. Cleanse. And just remove it all together. Why does it not have a divider? Like, I have no idea. Oh, why is it not working? <laughs> why is it not working? It should work. Maybe, maybe I'm just bad. Okay, I need a divider class here. Yeah. Uh, maybe uh, I need to put content and should do that. No. Hmm. I should also make this flex, by the way. Okay, okay. Now it's working. And then this is item center. Okay. Or is it item center or item center? <coughs> mm. I think it should be items end for everything. So let's do that instead okay 
And then let's do this. And put it here. This is a sort by. So I need dev, another dev. Sort by spam. Class. Same, same thing. Spam class and then sort by. Oh, it's wrong. And then I need a drop down. It's a drop down, right? Tailwinds. I mean, they see why. Drop down? It's, that's a drop down, right? <coughs> drop down with icon. I don't have an icon. Sort by, I guess I'll just copy the code. I mean, it's too dish thing, and it's too big, it's too big, it's too big. Uh, <clears throat> Let's see, what do I do? This thing, this thing should be a BG word. Okay, last appointment should be text slate 500. And then I need the alignment, man. The alignment. <laughs> so this thing should be aligned here. This is hard. But I need to also. It's the border radius. The border radius is significantly lower. So I'm sure it's not rounded. So maybe it's something like. Uh, Yeah, the one just I'm pretty sure it's it's like around the one or something. No. Rounder. Rounded one. It's rounded one? Rounded zero. Rounded none. Rounded one is too big. Yeah, rounded one is too 
two, two round. I mean, two round. It should, it's two round. Rounded, uh, maybe five pixels. Point, point five, point one rem. Something small. Point two rem. Yeah, I think point two rem is okay. Point three rem. Okay, this is the hard part, okay? Because if you see the, the the alignment here, right, is that this is aligned end. This thing is aligned end, if you see. And then this thing is like, maybe it's all aligned end. No, 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 it's not all aligned end. No. The reason I can say that is because, yeah, this is aligned, but this thing is like this. So the text is aligned. Hmm. How do you do that, that the text is aligned? But the elements are not. Uh, CSS text aligned. Text aligned. But maybe vertical. Is it vertical alignment? Vertical elements are not. I'm not sure how you do it. Text. Is there like a text CSS text align um, bottom? Is it like a text align? Maybe it's text align. Display flex is something which is important. Maybe it's vertical align. Oh, it's image. It's image. Maybe it's text center. Or maybe it's like just if yeah. Mm. But it's weird because like if it was centered, right, this would be lower. So yeah. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm just maybe it's centered and then they just adjusted it up. So instead of items end, I'm going to make this item center. Let's see if that works. Okay, items center. Okay, that is weird. I'm going to make this items end. And then I need to adjust it a bit. So MB1, MB2. I think this is what they did. I might be wrong. See, I just adjusted it. And then I need to remove the divider. I need to remove a bit of padding above. So I think this should be MB1, even MB0. I wouldn't be surprised if it was MB0. It's not a lot. Yeah, it's not a lot. So maybe MB1, this should also be MT1. Where's the divider? Oh, uh, this T1. Okay, I wouldn't be surprised if it was like this. And then I need to change the I need to change the ori uh, not orientation the the thing the thing I need to change the where it's opening right it should be it should be here it should be here so how do you do that? Align items and align items to end. So she means where? 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 How do you align it to end? I'll drop down end. Okay, okay. Drop down end. Thank you, thank you. Ah, oh, it's still not working. Okay, it's not working. And I need to change the rounded box to rounded point three M. And then cool, 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 cool. And then I need to add an icon. I need to add an icon, so we're going to use <clears throat> an icon, right? We're going to use uh, drop towns or chevron. I think it's called chevron. Chevron, <laughs> the brand, the car brand. 
Oh, it's so slow. This is what I don't like about this side. It's that it's so slow. I want to rebuild this side. <laughs> so slow. The chevron. I'm not sure why it's called chevron. Don't ask me why. Chevron up, chevron down. Is there like a component for just a chevron? Is there? Let's see, chevron. There's none. So I need to add that uh, component. So I'm going to do this and then do this and then put this here. And then just hope for the best that it works. That it did not break anything. Uh, where is the component? Oh, there, it's too big. But that's expected. I'm going to remove the stroke, the stroke grid, and the stroke line cup brown stroke line. I'm going to remove this. Uh, it's gone now because there's no stroke. But I'm also going to remove the width and the height. So we don't need that. Uh, instead, we can add like a class. I think it's like with four or something with four h4 and then stroke <clears throat> stroke white stroke uh what's the color of this what color what color i don't follow that is i think it's that slate brown so let's a six all right stroke slate 500 and then we need to add the red stroke width it's or stroke stroke, stroke width right stroke two. Oh, i forgot the, how do you add a stroke width i wonder how i did it here let's see I forgot i forgot i forgot okay people forget things okay there's no more Okay, like okay, stroke width. I just did not. I guess I just did this instead. 2.5. There. Much better. And then we're going to make this flex sort by. <coughs> Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I keep. It's gone. It's gone. Oh, there. It's this thing. Tau index 0. What's in. That I, either I make it flex or I just, you know, I just add like a margin. ML, maybe three. Yeah. Yeah. And then menu. This will be not 52, maybe 62. What? There's no 62. <laughs> With hey, with sixty, with sixty, okay, with sixty. Just with sixty. Other. Okay. okay. Should I move it? <clears throat> Or maybe 70 because because of the sort by like just just so it matches oh what did i do i did not do anything okay i did not do anything shift 11. what did i do why is it dovidash what um uh, why is it full screen how do i exit full screen control shift b full screen Full screen, we double full screen, 11. Okay. I press something that I'm not supposed to press. <laughs> okay, okay. Did things change? VE, DJ minus X. VE, DJ. This is why you should alias, okay? It's so cool, so fast. You just. Okay. Why is it not working? Why is it not working? It should work. There's no width 70, I guess. Width 72. 
that's too big so 66 with 64 that's it 64 there's nothing that's the I guess that's good enough <clears throat> Is there a way for me to move it more? Like I want to align this, but that's just me. <laughs> I don't want to do that thing, so I'm not going to put menu. Okay, okay, that's that's better. That's better. So I could, you know. If three. Or maybe P2. Select class P2. And then, uh, of course, uh, wait, no, 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 uh, hover, 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 no, 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 BG, gray, 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 what's the BG of this, what's the BG of this, what did I put here, it's a 500, BG, gray, 200. PG gate PG gray 200 and then active PG gray 300. Okay, okay, okay. Let me just copy this thing. Copy that. Okay, that's how you do it. Then that's how. That's how you do. It. And then I want to remove the padding because I don't need the padding. I don't need the padding here. But I now I because I removed the padding there, now I need more padding, so padding four here. Now that's too much. Maybe padding four pa PX4 and then PY2. PY3. PX4 PY3. How about that? Something like yeah, PX PX four PY maybe maybe PY two even. P PY three. PY three it is. It's PX four is like it it seems so small. Now I need to make the font smaller. The font, well, I think it's text XM. Okay. And select none. Yeah. Select none. I think that's better. That's better. The moon item too. <clears throat> okay, 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 okay. Uh, let's see how far I am. Very far. <laughs> 700 patients. I need to move this more to the... But it's... Yeah, I think I should, I should move it more to the right. That's, that's more padding than I thought it had. Well, maybe it's because I'm, I'm, uh, no, it's too cramped. 
Yeah, I, I, I can see it. I can see it. It's too cramped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh what do I do? Less. Maybe I'll add a class here of no no P X P L maybe three maybe five even. No, I cannot even do that because because of a divide loss. So I cannot do that. Uh, uh, how do I do this? How do I do it then? <clears throat> so 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 so. Oh, or is it? Say it's about equal, right? Okay, okay, whatever. So, show, 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 that's five. Maybe PX7 instead. E, PX7. Where's PX5? And then the top nav, top nav, top nav. Yes, five make it yes, seven. Okay, okay. I think that's better. It's better, I think. I'm not sure if that's it. Maybe it's even PX8. I don't know. I'm very bad at eyeballing. Maybe it's even PX10. Let's see PX10. PX10. It's too far. Pakistan might be too far. Pause me is like maybe I'm just looking at. Pakistan, Pakistan seems to work for so maybe PX8. <clears throat> okay, fine. Let's go with PX8. So PX7, PX7, I'll make it PX8. And replace replace all yes. okay over the good side okay okay and then <coughs> what else I need this three items uh last appointment it's actually more it's wide all, it's more wide all, so let's see, let's see, last appointment. <coughs> last appointment, maybe it's not an option, or rather an option. Okay, I think I'm on five, it's okay. I wonder what the M1 is for. Do you really need the M1? I'm not sure. Why not just... Ah, why not just... Ah, I think it's because the drop down, they can move around. But there's always a gap. I think that's, that's what the M1 is for. <coughs> okay, okay, okay. Now I need these three things. I need a printer icon. And it's going in a filter. Let's drop down. I'm guessing this is like 
flex and then this one is like flex reverse or is it like space between two items This one is like justify, justify between just flex everything, right? Just put it, just everything in the in a flex box. Put everything in a flex box, and it just it will work. So the same thing, but now I can add stuff here. Let's see. Okay, it works the way I think it should work, and then. It should still be class flex. Item center. <coughs> and I need two buttons. Need three icons. Mm. I need a three buttons. Class dot button times three. Uh, BG should be white, BG white, BG white, BG white. And the gap should be maybe three. Is it three? No, more like one. Yeah, okay, okay. And then, uh, should be button square. Should it be bottom square or something? At least bottom square. Okay, okay. Bottom, bottom square. Now I need... Okay, I have three buttons. Now I need the icon for a printer. I need a printer. <laughs> I don't think it has a printer though. Oh, it has a printer. Okay, just copy this and then paste. So it's weird, so... <coughs> did I fill this or did I... That's late for hundred. Here it was none. That's so weird. It's, it's not filled, but so why is it filled? I don't know. I don't know. Don't ask me. I forgot. <laughs> oh, okay, it's really close now. <coughs> We're going to remove the width and the height. The V box will stay at this. And we're going to also remove the things here. Oops. Oh, it was too bad. We don't need that. Okay, wait, why is there a feel? Uh, class equals W4, H4, let's see, let's see, it doesn't work because I don't have a G gray 500. Okay, it doesn't work. Tax 500. Tax gray 500. It doesn't work. I need to put the fill color. Is that what you're trying to say? 
Do I really need to do that? Or maybe because I don't have a stroke quest. No. I don't think I need a stroke quest, boss. Come on, I feel that it's a, it's a, it's a solid color. It's not a... I wonder why. I wonder why I was able to. How do you do fail? CSS fail. CSS SVG fail. Okay, there's a fill property. So fill, fill, grave, I wonder. Okay, there is one. And then I need to make it bigger. 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 So maybe with a five, maybe? Which of six? Which of five? It's the point makes. It's too big. I think that's good enough. Should I make it smaller? I think it's good enough. Maybe they should be a bit of seven, maybe? I don't like. <laughs> There's no width of seven, I think. With a there is, there is real of seven. Why does it not work? Maybe it has also, it also has to be H of seven. Uh, it's too big. Maybe H six. Six, that's six. That's too big. I think five is okay. Five is okay. And then add more gap. So, oh my god, I don't know what I clicked again. I keep on, I keep on messing it up. Okay. And I have to again, <clears throat> but gladly I I guessed it. <laughs> you know, it's not really a law for me no sense yeah so easy when we have all this set up okay then i need a filter 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 and a filter okay i have it and then i put it here i just again i need just need to remove the <clears throat> Yes, no, I just remove the color. I wonder if there's like a shortcut to go to the end of the line. Let's see this VS go shortcut go to the end of the line. Is that Control K. Um, I don't have an FN. Oh, I have an FN. It doesn't work. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, whatever. I know in uh, Vim you, there's a way to do it quickly. Filter, 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 filter. Then I just filter. And I just need to make this. Let's um, add a bit of a uh, gap. Maybe three. 
It doesn't work. I forgot to add a class of W. Maybe uh, I forgot I would move the button square. Remove the button square because it's not a square anymore. Uh, w5, H5, and uh, fill gray 500. Forgot to add the classes. Okay, okay, okay. Then, similar classes to last appointments. Let's say 500, run the point M. I forgot to add the thing. So. Then I'll go back to the buttons. I'll go back to the buttons. I'll go back to the buttons. Buttons, buttons. Okay, okay, okay. Then what's the last one is edit columns so that it's pain. I think that's like a pain. It's either pain or window. So window, maybe it's window. There's no okay, okay. I know I've seen it before. Is it filled? My question was is it filled? It's not filled, so I'm going with outline. I've seen it before. I'm hungry, so let me eat while I'm recording. Quite a good, I have snacks. <laughs> Biscuit, but whatever. I'll be back in a bit. <laughs>
I just bought some snacks. <laughs> I have biscuit here, but it's not enough. I'm really hungry. Yes, yeah, some more. <laughs> yeah, it. Something like this. But it's like a half right. It's like a pain. A window pane. I know I've seen it before. If it's not here, I'm going to go to Tabler Tabler Icons. Mm. What I need is not here. But I can use something else. It doesn't have to be the exact icon. Oh, I have a viewer. Hi. <laughs> mm, what should I use? This, 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 any, anything, anything. Mm, maybe this. 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 There it is. Edit, 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 uh, edit column, column, edit column. I guess I'll just use this. Whatever. So, 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 I'm just going to, to, to paste that thing and then remove, remove the width, remove the width, remove the fill, remove. Class W believe five H five. Uh, what else? Fill gray five hundred. Fill gray five hundred. Okay. Okay. Uh, wait a minute. It's not fill. <laughs> it should be stroke. It's stroke. It should be stroke. Mm -hmm. Uh, and the reason why that's happening is because there's a thing here. Mm, there's a yeah. There's this thing here somewhere, and then I just need to add a stroke back. Stroke equals two two point five. Do I use two point five or two something? Ah, uh, why is it like that? No idea. <laughs> Maybe I remove too much. Am I have removed too much? Wait, 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 wait. Should work, right? Why is it not working? I think I heard, I might have removed too much. Okay, okay. Ah, because it should be stroked with. My bad. It's not stroke. It should be stroked with. Keep on forgetting the things, but. And then stroke rounded, as if like stroke rounded. How do you do rounded strokes again? Tailwind, tailwind, tailwind CSS. It's actually not complete. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
Okay. It's not complete. Okay. We're going to put this and then paste it here and then make this 2.5 and it should work. Okay. It's not working. I don't know why. Not working. Why is it not working? Hmm. Okay. It works now. Now I need to build the thing. This thing. I think it's a table, right? Okay, I'll use a table for it. Uh this is you are this you are this you are, table table table. I wonder how I would add the gap though. This thing, there's a gap, right? I wonder how I do that. I'm thinking it's not really that there's a gap. I have a feeling that there's, it's not that there's a gap. I think this there's a container within the thing, which is this white thing, and then there's a table. It's still a table. It's still part of the table. So it's like there is not a gap. It's more so like there's a container and there's a margin within like the TD. TD and then it, I think that's that's how they did it. Margin top and margin bottom. And margin top, margin bottom. But I might be wrong. So I'm just going to I guess copy, copy. It's not a it's not a zebra table. It's not with an active row. This is the closest with visual elements. Right. This is the closest, so this is, this is what I'll copy, 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 copy the code and just hope for the best. Okay, okay. 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 I don't need the avatar, so I'm going to remove all the avatars. Uh, it's in GR, GR, GR. I don't need to have a 
I don't know why it's not getting removed, but I don't need the avatar. I still don't need why it's not still don't get why it's not getting removed. Alright, it's getting removed now. Ah, uh, so it's uh, the avatar. Give me the avatar. I don't need the avatar. It's far. Okay. Okay. This is what I need. <clears throat> oh, it works like this. Ah, oh, this is the footer. Hmm. And then you just leave it there. Let's see, what do I have in the database? Plants, 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 what plants? So I have a fence number, type, level. I think I have it in my spider girl. We'll have to. I wonder what this is. Oh, what do we do? It's not really updated. Well, let's make a table anyways. Uh, how many rows do I want? Yeah, there's like, I mean, how many columns? I mean, not rows. It's like a good chunk. One, two, three, four, five, six, six columns. Um, would be like reference number is important. Huh. Hmm. I'm not even sure if I if there's a contact number, contact number, there's none. I think you can color code it. Like different color depending on the client. We have three types of client type. Multi-chain, 
student and then teacher. I don't even think I have email. Yeah, I don't have email. So maybe level. Name and then level below. Or should I do it like school? Name and then school. There's school, right? There's school. The street address and then there's school. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Do I need the age? I don't think I need the age. Do they need the age? Last record, last medical record, next appointment. Maybe last updated. Last, last. Uh, mm, I don't know. I'm pretty bad at these things. Okay, okay. Had the had check box. Okay, that's okay. It's basic. Basic, uh, wait, what? Base, basic info. Info, no, it's code. Phone number, no. It's code, oh, it's cool. I don't have a phone number per se. So, like, let's say it's cool and then city. I don't have, like, a phone number in the record. That's why I can't really do that. And details. Instead of details, Make it three dots so you cannot click it. Is that what this thing is like? Oh, okay, okay. You can edit it in line or something. And then, okay, okay, now I get it. I get it. I get it. Maybe school city and then uh, last updated. Last updated. Uh, what do you call last updated medical record? Last up, last check out. Last check out. Last check up. Last check up. Last updated medical record term. History of the last check up. What do you call it? Check up. Check up. Is it called check up? Meaning? Sure, it's not. Okay, last check up. I guess last. And then we can do create. It's the last one. Register date. I think last checkup is much.
Okay. This is the name of the client, right? The name of the client. So I'm going to push for client and clients. Is it TR? No, no, no. It should be here. It should be here for client and clients. And then, then and then end for. And then I'm going to copy path and then format dj ml ah, minus v2. Okay, okay, okay. We cooking though, we cooking. Okay. And then and then and then and this is client that first name, client dot name. This is client dot name, I think it suffice. But I'm not sure. Cool. Okay, it works. And then this is client that title. They're all in the Philippines, so a client that level, not title. It should be title, right? Not level. It's so bad. It should be client that title. Bad. I'm really bad at naming things. Why is this Brazil? What? No idea why. Maybe it's the cash. Hmm, I think I know why. That. And the sugar. That. Spent the school. The stop stops mission. Why is the this thing? Wonder. Wonder. And then DD purple, this is client that's that CD dot name. Ah, 
uh, <laughs> there was this one time that I was I did fizzbuzz, you know, using a map or something. Or I, I was just curious. Okay, Cause normally when you think of fizz fizzbuzz, you think of if statements, and then some. Uh, but like I've read that it's not like the best solution. I'm like, what? There's there's a solution. There's another solution. <laughs> And then we can do PR. Uh, region, no, not region prop. Province, maybe. Region PR. And then I could do the same here. See? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Then last check up is last updated, right? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, type NTP updated date time. Do I need to include the age? Region ID, points ID, street address, age, last name, first name, updated date time, just none. So I guess I'll just use updated date time. No, this should not be TP, this should be TD, and then... Uh, updated date time. I need to format this. <laughs> I need to format this. Uh, format. How do you format a date? Uh, Jinja, Jinja format date time. Oh, you could actually do that. <laughs> I'll just use the RF plan. Um, all right, it's more like day, month, uh, month, day, and then see. It doesn't work. <laughs> Could not parse the remainder. Uh, why does it not work? It should work. STRF time. Oh, this is ginger. <laughs> this is ginger. Uh, I'm not using ginger. Django template uh, format time. Format date time. 
not sure if we can do it. Okay, okay, there's there's a date field or something. Okay. Dates much better now, much better. Then it should work. Ah oh my god, it doesn't work. <laughs> Why does it not work? Ah, because you don't need a percent sign. I maybe it's M? Maybe it's M? Okay there. No. Much better. Much better. <laughs> Let's check off. Okay, okay, okay. The, the checkbox is too big. Can I reduce the size of the checkbox? How do you read they see you I they see you they that they see you I reduce Oh wait, maybe I can is there like checkbox checkbox SM? Checkbox checkbox SM yeah. Okay there is. And then rounded none. I don't want it to be rounded. Or maybe it's rounded by like point point three rem. Yeah, something like that. Or maybe point one rem, not point three. Point two rem. Okay, okay. Box check box as in box. Much better, much better. I'm not sure if it should be X. I think it's, it's okay. It's okay. No one would complain. It's too big. I don't really mind that it's too big. I think I like. I kind of like it. That it's too big. Fine, let's change SM to XS. It's too small now. It seems too small. I think it should be. I think I prefer it when it's worse. Less now. Okay, whatever, <laughs> whatever. Move on. Let's move on. And then I need to, I need to add a background color to every TD. TD, where's TD? Why do I have a lot of checkbox by the way? Like I'm curious. Where's the other checkboxes? I only see. Oh, it counts it. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay. Okay, okay. Did he did this thing? This thing, right? Maybe class of uh, BG White. BG White. Okay, okay, okay. And then maybe can I do this? MB3. Can I add a padding or something? I knew I cannot do that. <laughs> I knew that I cannot do that. Okay, you cannot do that. Uh, maybe, 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 hmm, let me think, let me think, let me think. So, I need a BG white. Hmm, so. It's not BG white, so I think, should I put this in a div? Can I do that instead? What if I do that? What would happen if I put it in a div? And then put, make the dev BG white. Would that work? I don't think it will work though. I knew it didn't work. <sighs> it ignores the dev. <laughs> it's so sad. <laughs> I hate myself. It's not working at all. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, how do I do it? Maybe not a table, but it doesn't make it doesn't make sense not to use a table. If you get what I mean, it does just doesn't make sense at all not to use a table. Hmm. So I guess let's go back to the previous one. And then dr class pg1. Okay, let's go to here first. And then, turn. Uh, this is round uh, point three one. It doesn't work. I have no idea why it doesn't work. It should work, but it doesn't work. So yeah. I wonder how you do it. I really do wonder. What's that table bro? I'm gonna rush recruits. Uh, base that HTML. Let's make this body class max. Let me believe max H screen. Max H screen. Or maybe X H screen. Okay, max H screen and then overflow why shouldn't it doesn't work. Why does it not work? <laughs> Maybe it's nuts. Do I need to rebuild it? Okay, now it works. Uh okay, okay. And then I'll go back to client list and make this overflow. Overflow Low. It doesn't work. Overflow why scroll. It's not scrolling. Hmm. Maybe the terrible this overflow why scroll. Overflow auto. It's not scrolling. Hmm. 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 I wonder why it's not scrolling. Table overflow why Overflow, overflow auto is not, you know, scrolling. I don't know why. Why is...
table also one <laughs> doesn't work why does it not work Maybe because uh max H cream move that uh don't show scroll ball shows not body. Maybe I should not use a table. I'm thinking maybe I should not use a table. Maybe I should use a grid instead. If I want to customize it. Yeah. And maybe I should use a grid instead. <laughs> uh, let's see if there's a grid here. Like a grid system instead. Okay, it doesn't have it. So maybe here. I won't use a table. I'll use grid instead. Or maybe this, there's like a list. Is there like a list group? List, list, list. There's no list. That's sad. It's really sad. I was hoping there was a list. Pagination. Pagination. I think I would need pagination too. Uh, uh, let's do grid first. Yeah, yeah, maybe I, I should use it. Something like this. Instead, instead of the... <sighs> instead of the table, because, yeah.
Today. Maybe I should set the height instead. Like the maximum height of this is like the computation of this this thing. It's like uh five five point five RAM, right? Yeah, still. It's not the min height, it should be the max height. But yeah, whatever. I'll I'll fix it later. Uh okay, 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 okay. Mm, what was it again? Checkbox. This is the checkbox. Is the chuck box so 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 so? And somewhere here, let's go with table. You have to copy it again. I'm again, again, again. Class chuck box, chuck box. Remember, it's like SM or something. Box SM and around the point three RAM. Point three RAM. Okay, checkbox, checkbox. So here, table row group. Oops. And dot. Input the checkbox. I don't know. No, 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 no. I'll just copy this and paste this. And I'm going to remove the other rows because I don't need them. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. And wait, what? Wait, what, 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 what? Okay, it's only three. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Uh, so I remember it was that and it's basic info is basic info basic info basic info uh, this is school this is uh, city uh, what is it again city uh, last last check and then there's nothing here. Something. Okay, 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 okay. Did you mention my show? Listen, listen. Flex and item center. Okay, I cannot use display flex how do you center a table how do you center a table Uh, tailwind align center it doesn't work Surprise, surprise, it doesn't work. 
Oh my god, it doesn't work. Maybe I should not use a table instead. <laughs> Maybe I should not use a table. I was thinking I should use a grid. I'm really bad with grids though. It's the thing, I'm really really bad with grids. I wonder how to win a bit. I mean, it just worked for Tailwind, I guess. I mean, for DCUI, I guess. Hmm. So, should I use this bias solution? <laughs> now I'm going back to the other solution. Because it's the same thing. Like, if I use Tailwind solution, it's still, it's still the same thing. Ah, uh, my issue is like... I don't want it to overflow. So maybe, 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 I'm thinking max heights screen. So it doesn't work. Max H. Oh, maybe 100 VH. Minus 50. Yeah. It doesn't work. It doesn't just doesn't work. I don't know why it doesn't work. Oh, there, there, there. It cuts it. It cuts it. And then um, overflow. It cuts it here. Okay, okay. But my question is how do you. Maybe, 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 maybe. Put it here instead. Maybe it's very good. Max height. And it's too big. It's 50 very sharp. I just touch it. Let's just go with that. And it doesn't work. I don't know why it just doesn't work. Overflow, overflow. Maybe I need to make it fit. They both fit. Fix. I wonder how you do it. How to how to limit limit table height.
Okay, okay. So, so... What's the height of this? I just need to subtract it from the height of this. I'm guessing this is like... Big is this? Big is just how it is. It's the six pixels, which is roughly... The six pixels in run. Oh wait, no. Divide by sixteen. Divide by sixteen or divide by ten. Eight point five. Maybe it's divide by ten. Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, maybe it's divide by ten. So five point six. No, it's not 5.6. It's 6 RAM. Maybe it's 7 RAM. Maybe it's 8 RAM. Maybe it's 10 RAM. Almost there. Maybe it's 12 RAM. Maybe it's 14 RAM. Okay, it's not 14 RAM, it's like 13.5 RAM. Um, 13.6 RAM. Um, no, no, 13 RAM. Um. Maybe it is 13. I don't know. Change? Uh, I don't really know how to change this photo. Uh, my question is how to scroll. Is this because there's uh, somewhere? Okay, okay, whatever, whatever. I'll... And then I need to I need to add the icon, the three dot icon, right? So by us. Uh, tailwind, uh, fix, oh no, no, sticky, 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 sticky. sticky. Okay, okay, so th, th, I mean, this is the R class equals sticky up zero. And then BG, whatever the BG is. What color is this thing? What color is the body? It's just slate 100. Slate 100. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. OP1. It's not OP1, it's like Z9999. Okay, there. Okay, okay, it works. <laughs> okay, okay. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then. It's really pretty cool. Oh wait, 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 wait. I can still move it down to maybe 14 now. No, not 14 round. Uh, 12 round. No, it's not 12 round, so 12.5 round. Okay, 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 Twelve point seven round. Right? 
12.8 RAM. 12.8, 12.8, okay. Okay. It's really cool, right? Like, it's really cool that, you know, it's loads so fast because I'm using, uh, I'm using, I'm using HDMX. That's why it's really cool. And then I need to change the background of this checkbox. I need to change the background. So label class equals PG. Okay, doesn't work. Maybe shut. Would you what? Accent what? Why did it change the this UI checkbox? I don't even know checkbox. I really want to know custom colors. It'd be as simple as think. Okay. Let's start playing. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's cool. Okay, okay. Another thing that I should do is uh and then at SVG, right? SVG to edit it. But I don't think that's how I should do it. Because I think I should do pagination instead. Right? Pagination. Instead of touching all the data, why not just paging over? Whatever. Let's see, Django, Tailwind, Django, Tailwind, Region May, Table.
Jungle page and make. Okay, okay, <laughs> it doesn't work that way, I guess. Django, dango that core that paginator import paginator terminator <laughs> it sounds like a terminator and then paginator 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 uh clients twenty five. Page number, page on end, plus end, plus stop, plus stop, okay, stop. Page opt plus clients and this. List is not a function. So we think about let's say make it ten. Okay, I make it eleven. Okay, it's so ten. Done, done, done. 
And then region ish. What's <laughs> what? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, just you no know, went and peed. <laughs> just went to the bathroom real quick, real quick. Uh, ordered by Django. Alas, ordered by. Order by uh, what is the name? Updated daytime, updated daytime. Um, order by minus. Set Doesn't work. Uh, maybe minus a little bit. Okay. Okay. And then and then and then and then and then. I want I want it to be paginated, right? I want it to be paginated. I'm thinking maybe this. If num plants greater than ten, uh, show the pigeonation, show this thing. It's not showing. Why is it not showing? I have no idea. Ah, and patience.
Just to begin to guess. I guess it's better, I'm not sure. I'm just, you know, taking a guess. Why is there a huge gap, by the way? I'm actually pretty curious. Maybe I should put this here instead. And I'll just, I'll just add like a one. I oh, not M B M C one M C one M C okay and then instead of maybe I'll just give out eight okay fine nine let's go with nine. Okay, how do you get the number of pages? Jungle pagination, how do you get the number of pages?
see if it works first. How many pages would this be? List values. Huh? Default tabs. Range. Len. I don't get it. I'm pretty sure it's it's an int, right? I'm sure it's an int. I'm sure it's an int. Am I wrong? Okay, it's twelve pages. Whatever. Uh, loop, ginger, uh, jungle, temperate, loop, or loop. Sorry. Mm, for key value for x y and points i need something where yeah it's just do, do i have like a while loop while loop. there's no while loop hmm uh jim jim with some make list Okay, I'll just create a range then. Numpage range. Range one numpages.
Last one. What? Let's just see if it works. It's 12 pages, right? It's 12 pages. Well, by which? No. Straight to start with two. I... It's not working. Why is it page now? Page. Okay. But the issue is, uh, this is a bad solution. <laughs> this is a bad solution. I think the correct solution would be. Correct solution would be this thing, the Django, this thing, on each side. The default file is for it. Do you mean that on n is equals to? Ah, okay, okay, I get it, I get it. Okay, get a leaded page range. Why is number? Get a leaded page range. And I don't know why it's not working. Ah, because it's non pages, page range. Disabled buttons. Button disabled. Button spread. Button disabled.
Uh... I wonder why. Ellipsis, right? There were close ellipsis, so I don't get why it's not working. I wonder why it's not working. Tailwind. And then button disabled. Button square. That is so weird because, like, pages. Uh, uh, what's equal to this? So, maybe. Uh, okay, okay. J Django. Uh, template. Check if and. I wonder why it's not getting forward. I really do wonder why. Why? <laughs> Why? Why?
Django Paginate Ellipsis Ellipse Yeah, it's triple dots. It's triple dots. I should check this. I don't know why it's not checking it. I wonder why it's not working. It should work. In my head, I'm like, this should work, right? This should work. Why is it not working? We need to not get why it's not working. So 
3, it's ellipsis. Okay, now I get it. I think I get it. It should be... I think it should have a space. Dot, 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 space. Okay. <laughs> uh, I wonder why it's not working. I just wanted to disable it, man. I just wanted to disable it. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it so hard to disable it? Why is it so hard to disable it? Can I do like R? Rejects, rejects matching. How about rejects matching? Ah, that ellipsis. Ooh, that's how you do it. So that's how you do it. Uh, okay, okay. So you return the page nature. Mmm, I. F okay, okay. Page nature that ellipsis. Hmm. Page nature that ellipsis. Okay, okay. So you return the page option. Okay, okay, okay. So you turn the page ob page in tour. Hmm? Page object. Page object. Page you need to page. Page number. So clients. Okay, okay. So I already have the object, so I don't need that. Uh, page number. Page range. Okay, I don't need that. Okay, okay. So page and clients. The page. Page nature that. Get I said get a lid get get a get a lid get a lid page range and then if page number okay now for page equals Clients that page in night page in night turn it up ellipsis there there okay button disabled Okay. Uh now I want to 
change the color. I want to change the color of the button disabled. How do I do that? And then PG in the gray. Five hundred. PG gray four hundred. I cannot change the color. This is so sad. I cannot change the color. Why can I not change the color? Oh, wait, wait. Instead of button disabled, I can make it pointer invents none. Pointer invents none. It's the same thing. Yeah. 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 Can you get 100? Maybe 200. And then hover. I want to change the hover. PG 100. I cannot really change the hover. VG very 100 I cannot change that unless I remove the button class Ah, it's a radio, it's a radio, so I can't I wonder what this is. I want it to be uniform. So I'm going to check what's 200 and 300. So PG go 300. Active PG go 300. Okay. Okay, okay. And then I just need to put this in the center. I just need to put this in the center. Uh maybe how do I do it? How do I do it? How do I do it? Um It's inline flex, so there, theoretically I can do this. Align self. No, 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 I cannot do it. Item self. Self. Self center. Self center. I should be able to do this, right? No, I cannot. Uh, self. Or maybe I'll just do a max auto. Let's work. No, it doesn't work. Ah! <laughs> Maybe if I have a div, like a container, let's say I have a div here, 
I don't want to have a dev. I don't want to have a dev because I, I know I can do it with just uh like oh wait, why did I close it? Uh never mind. Uh 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 uh, uh, uh. Align self center. Align self. There's, there should be somewhere. Yeah, I should be able to do self center. But why can't I do that? Uh, flex, maybe I didn't make it flex first. I don't know why it's not working. Display flex. Ah, join is online, so I need to. Okay, fine, 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 fine. I'll put it inside of div, which has the the flex class, which has the class flex, and I'll align it center. I times center. Of course, I need to do MT3 or MT5 first. And it did not work. Why did it not work? Because it's stretching. Flex item center. Why is it not working? Just a fly center? No. I shouldn't need to do that. Okay, fine. So just apply something. It's not item something. But there. I guess the next step is to do the pagination. I don't really know how I do it, but it should be active, right? If page equals the current page, get page. If page equals current page, uh, Django pagination. How do you get the current page? Page, 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 page. Some pages has other pages. Turns a page object with a given. Page range. So do you get the current page the associated page in your object? Page dot number. Uh, if page dot number equals the page, if clients of page image. Then else F alert page uh clients that page nature that page dot number
active. Something like this. It doesn't work. Uh, <laughs> Find the page name number. I thought it returns a number. The nowadays page number for this page. Ah, clients that number. I think that's it. Okay, okay. So I'm going to replace clients uh, with. It should be all, no, no, it should be clients with page option. It's getting really conf confusing. <laughs> well, well, I can make it so that here it's like, would, actually no, what kind of page job just like that. Why? It's not clients anymore. Good job. Ah, but I'm not returning clients. I'm returning good job. I should no 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 no. I think I'll go with clients still, and then I'll make it, uh, since this is a pagination, right, I'll make it with, with page of plus clients, or something, with page of plus clients. And with this. And then clients dot page of dot what page of page page of dot okay. It's confusion. Then copy the copy copy the path and then we have to now MST2 DJ HTML. Okay, okay. Are we cooking? Are we cooking? We're not cooking. <laughs> Template syntax error. Why? 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 Red expects that at least one variable assignment. Uh, Django template with Django template with why is it not working? Where's the wood keyword? There's no wood keyword. What? Wood. Ah, okay, okay, fair enough. Page step number. Page.
There's no page dot number. Ah, page obsh dot number. Maybe that's my mistake. And then it should be one. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe that was my mistake. Page. It it should not be page dot number. It's page obsh. Ah, 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 ah. Else if how about Django template else if Django template else another spam it's LF, so I was correct. I was correct, but I'm still wrong. What? 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 Ah, I get, I, I get why I'm wrong. I get why I'm wrong. Cause it's not active class. <laughs> I'm not working with uh list items. I'm working with uh, I'm working with radio, and checkboxes, right? So I'm so stupid. <laughs> this is wrong. Uh, so it should be area level page, and this will be check. And and it. it should be if and that should work. See? Easy. Bam. And then I can just do this. That radio. Name options. Other page. Page number. And okay. Okay, 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 okay. And then I need to request the next page, okay? <laughs> uh, H, H, at click. So, H, X, H, X, trigger. Uh, H, X, trigger, click, uh, throttle. And then H, H. H X uh H X <laughs> H X get H X get equals uh when you click it you 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 know <laughs> you you uh you what you what mate you what request that get request that get hmm hmm Real Python pagination. Real Python pagination. What else do I need to do? How do you send a request? Ah, oh, you could also do that. Your L uh, terms for page.
Uh, keep on clicking Control T. That was uh, <laughs> no reverse much for a client list with arguments one, one not found. Uh, how about query parameter client list and then page equals page page equals page. How about that? Was I able to get the... Uh... Ooh, I am. I am. But the thing is not changing. Maybe HX swap is the main. And then HX select. Was to men. How about that? Hmm. Why is it? No, the pagination is working. I think. And then hx history. Hx push URL. But hx push. URL, I think. Is it? No, 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 no. Sidebar. Side light sidebar. Yeah, I was correct. LHX push URL. Clients. Ah, clients. There should be patient list. Client list should be patient list. Ah, it should be. But it's not working! Why is it not working? This is so unfair. Same clients? Maybe not get page, maybe it should be page. It's always page 1 of 12. It's always page 1 of 12. Why is it always page 1 of 12? Ah, that object list, so clients equals
Still not working. Uh, plants, plants. Still the same plants. Uh, <laughs> why is it not working? It should not be main, it should be uh do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Yeah, it should be ID clients, right? It's just, <laughs> I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Okay. <laughs> it's not moving. Well, this is that. I'm not sure. What is the object list? Page option. Print clients. Plans equals just, just empty, right? Well, now just make it empty. Uh, print page option dot. Page option. Object list. But the page doesn't change, which is weird. It's always none. It's always none. What? How do you get it? It's a query, right? It's a query. It's not.